Today we're diving into an important topic, the phase out of R22 refrigerant. Let's break it down and understand why this matters. R22, also known as chlorofluoromethane, has been widely used in air conditioners and refrigerators for years. It's effective, stable, and non-flammable, making it a go-to choice for cooling. But there's a problem. R22 contains chlorine, which depletes the ozone layer when released into the atmosphere. The ozone layer is crucial because it protects us from the sun's harmful violet rays. To tackle this issue, countries around the world signed the Montreal Protocol in 1987. This international treaty aims to phase out substances that harm the ozone layer, including R22. It's a significant step towards protecting our environment. Here's the timeline. In 2010, the US banned the production and import of R22 for new equipment. By 2020, the production and import of R22 were completely banned. Now only recycled, reclaimed, or previously produced R22 can be used for servicing existing systems. So how does this affect you? As the supply of R22 decreases, its cost has increased. Servicing systems that use R22 is now more expensive. Older systems may also need to be retrofitted or replaced to work with the newer environmentally friendly refrigerants. Fortunately, there are alternatives. R410A is a popular replacement that doesn't harm the ozone layer and is more energy efficient. Phasing out R22 is crucial for protecting our environment and our health. While it presents challenges, new technologies and proper planning make this transition achievable. Thanks for listening. Stay informed, stay proactive, and let's work together to keep the planet safe.